everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, we are going to be reviewing the eyeshadow palette from Kat Von D from her 10 year anniversary collection. Um, she did come out with several different things for this collection. Uh, she came out with a brush set for $125. Um, she came out with the Everlasting Glimmer Veil Liquid Lipstick for $22. Um, she came out with the Metal Crush Highlighter for $30. The Studded Kiss Creme Lipstick, $19. And the Anniversary Tattoo Liner, uh, which is just a repackaged liner for $20. She also came out with a train case, which if you follow me on Instagram or Twitter, you already know how I feel about that train case. That train case was $150 and the design was breathtaking, okay? But the quality of that train case was, I don't know how she could have signed off on something like that. It was absolutely terrible. And when I say terrible, I mean terrible. Um, the actual the train case isn't even on Kat Von D's website anymore I noticed that they took that down because there were so many bad reviews coming in the one on Sephora it's give or take but the one on their actual website it had like a two-star rating everybody was completely disappointed apparently it wasn't just like a one-time thing um, and that's really disheartening but Today, like I said, we're reviewing the eyeshadow palette. So this is what the packaging is like. It comes in a nice solid gold 10 year anniversary packaging. On the back, it does have all the colors and the names, which um, the names represent all the 10 muses that she uses for her inspiration. So I thought that was really cool. Um, on her Instagram, she kind of does um, one little mini video of every single muse that she has so that was really interesting to watch and find out where she gets her inspiration from so the Kat Von D eyeshadow palette is not only cruelty free but it is 100% vegan so this is going to be user friendly for anybody so with that being said oh my gosh this is the packaging itself Oh, so gorgeous right I cannot get enough look at that design that it's more beautiful in person than anything you could ever see online will show like it's breathtaking um, it does have her little signature here um, so the whole package is gold and then once again I'm sorry you'll see my little handprints all over the place but it does have the list of her eyeshadow names right here um, so, ah, hey, you get to see my light. It does have an extremely nice weight to it. Um, I love the fact that it does not feel plasticky. It just, it feels really luxurious and that is amazing. So you open it up and I'm gonna try not to blind you guys, but you do get a huge mirror. I mean, huge. Um, the whole entire top side is a mirror, which is really nice quality. I was able to hold this and do my makeup, and I really, really enjoyed that mirror. Um, so then these are your shades right here. The shades are absolutely breathtaking. They are so much prettier in person than they were um, online. And I was looking online all over the place trying to find swatches of these. Um, they didn't really feel accurate to me on the ones that they were showing. So we are gonna do swatches for you guys here today and then I will get into thoughts.
so here are all your swatches right here. I'm gonna bring it in close. We got the blue, which is a lot brighter blue than what they were showing online. And then of course, all these pretty colors right here. The green, oh my God, that green is gorgeous. All right, the gold, which I have on my eyes. I think the only one that swatched, uh, swatched kind of patchy is this one right here, um, but we can actually fix that right up. Look at this, okay? See, just a little bit more work. Uh, another swatch, and <laughs> that is like crazy pigmented right there. All right, so number one, of course, the shades are absolutely stunning. So not only are the shades incredibly gorgeous, um, they are so soft to the touch, like every every matte, every shimmer feels like heaven when you touch them with your fingers. Um, there is no fallout when working with this. I did not have any issues on my eyes today. I could have very well have done my foundation first and then done my eyeshadow, uh, there would have been no problem. This eyeshadow palette, you can actually create any kind of look that you want. You can do an everyday eye look, which I did do one on Saturday and I posted it on Instagram. I'm in love with this eye look. I will have that inserted right here somewhere. Anyways, <laughs> so these are this is the look that I created with this palette. Um, as you can see, it is very subtle. It's beautiful. I really enjoyed the eye look. Or you can do something bold like I did today. I went with the green and gold. Um, so this palette is extremely versatile with any looks that you can create. This is a really nice transition shade. Um, I have used uh, this in the crease. I've used this in the crease. Um, I actually have these on my eyes today. They are so easy to blend. She nailed it with this eyeshadow palette. It is absolutely 100% perfection. I really probably would have kicked myself if I missed this eyeshadow palette. I know it's limited edition, but if you can get your hands on it, you really, really should. Um, I am so mad at myself that I did not get this right away. I actually was going to, I talked myself out of it at first. Um, I was like, no, it's limited edition. You really don't need it. You have the Saint and Sinner. You have the, mat, uh, the middle matte palette. No, I still would have been extremely upset. It doesn't matter what I have in my collection. This palette is a perfect palette. I could take this and create any look I wanted to create with this. So this is definitely a good travel palette. It's a good everyday palette um, with a pop of color. Like I said, I would have been so upset yet if I had missed out on this palette. Now, you can get this palette on Sephora uh, website or you can also get this palette on Kat Von D. Um, I know it has been in and out of stock. Um, so, but it actually is in stock as I am making this video. Um, online at sephora.com it does run for $52 but it is a little pricey but it's worth it every penny of it is worth it and I am so excited to tell you guys that this palette is everything I wanted it to be this palette is perfection um, so and it does get like just below five stars it's like four and a half but I don't think it can get much better than that. Um, you know, there's always gonna be somebody who is disappointed somewhere, but not me. I'm in total love. I am love, I'm in awe. I highly, highly recommend this palette. It's just absolutely gorgeous. So if you are wondering about the websites or where to find them, I will have those linked down below. I will have the Kat Von D website uh, linked down below and the Sephora website as well. So if you guys did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button before you go. That way you can be aware of any future videos that I have. I normally post on Mondays and Fridays. You can also follow me on Instagram and Twitter, and I will have those linked down below as well. And I will see you guys on my next video. Bye.